Hi, it's me, Tom, again. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a Zyxel digital media adapter to your home network so that you can access your videos through your Twonky Media Manager on your television. All right, we're back here in the living room. We have our Zyxel DMA1000 and our television set. The Zyxel's real simple to connect. Of course, you have to plug it into the wall first. I've connected it to my TV with a HDMI cable, and also we connect it to our home network with an internet cable. Now it's worth noting here that the Zyxel does not support Wi-Fi, so you will need to connect it to your router with an internet cable. Also, if you don't have an HDMI cable, you can connect the Zyxel to your television set with an S-Video cable and also an AV cable. Now to connect to your home network, use the Zyxel's remote control to select the media server by clicking the server option. Once you're in, you'll see a list of all of the media servers that are currently running. Now keep in mind, I only have one server running, the Office PC, and right away the Zyxel sees my music, photos, and videos. I can now use the control to select what I'd like to see or hear and start playing music. Dancing Queen, awesome. In addition to being able to pull videos from my Twonky Media Manager on the Zyxel, I can actually use the Twonky Media Manager to drag and drop a video right to the DMA1000, and it'll start playing automatically. The great coral reefs. That's about it. That's all you need to get your Zyxel digital media adapter working with your Twonky Media Manager. Now, if you have any questions, don't forget to visit us at twonkyforum.com. Post questions and interact with the Twonky Media community.